Recently, Brigadier General Freeman Robert Mugabe was appointed as the chairman of the general court marshal to replace Lieutenant General Andrew Guti. Guti has today handed over instruments of power to his successor. <laughs> Brigadier General Mugabe promised service to the people of Uganda and the Commander-in-Chief. Brigadier General Mugabe, however, called for teamwork and support to effectively carry out his mandate. Mindful that we deliver as a team. I'm simply a ship captain, but we collectively enjoy the scoreboard. The Chief of Defense Forces, General Wilson Basumbadi, who officiated the handover, tasked the Special <laughs> Investigation Branch Bureau to carry out speed inquiries to address the challenge of case backlog. Pending high profile cases, um, investigative matters you mentioned about, so SID, pull up your socks, and improving the terms and conditions of service. And this is uh, generally being taken care of. General Badi highlighted the key issues Brigadier General Mugaba is supposed to handle. We must bear in mind the norms, values, and aspirations of the people. As vanguards of justice and as practitioners, we are accountable to the constitution of the people and reliable and reliable to the law, the primary of which is the UPDF Act, which we must apply with all manner of integrity. Brigadier Felix Klaije, the UPDF spokesperson, applauded Lieutenant General Guti for his achievement as the chairman of the court. In his term, he has handled, of course, high-profile cases that many of them, some of you know. Three, there is the challenge of the interference of the civil court that uh, normally some suspects come with the court decisions or orders halting the trials. And as a law-abiding judicial system, we do follow those orders and hold some of the trials, even when evidence is available. Four, indeed, we are grateful as an army, the General Guti, for executing his duties expeditiously. Yes, he has handed over court when there are some, uh, there's a backlog. There are cases that are pending the trial, Indeed, there are people who are on remand in the various prisons that uh, the new chairman and his team must expeditiously handle so that this backlog is reduced. Lieutenant General Guti has chaired the general court marshal for six years. Over 3,000 pending cases await Brigadier General Mugabe. Prominent ones include that of former Inspector General of Police, Kari Kaihura, who is facing charges of failure to protect war materials, failure to supervise police officers, and a betting kidnap. The former commander of police special operations, senior superintendent of police, Nixon Agassiri, is also facing charges, aiding and abetting kidnaps of Rwandan refugees. Other cases that are not yet concluded involve 39 national unit platform supporters and a case of murder against prominent court bailiff Moses Chirunda. Flavian Inkuze for CTV, PM Edition.